I guess not all heroes wear capes, right? Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Rags to Wizard. Here we are back again with Kenny at our little house doing little house Kenny stuff. Let me give you a little tour of what what I've done. Um, I have gone ahead and reorganized our garden. Um, winter is coming. It's quickly on its way. So I went ahead and moved our orchard and some of our plants here uh, to the back. We have just stepped into winter. So all of our trees are becoming bare and we have little snowflakes that are falling. So we're very excited and thankful that we have our nice little house so that Kenny can stay warm. And our little gnome here is just delighting us with seed packets. So we're gonna just hop into it. Oh, wait, actually, before we get started, I discovered something. We are accumulating talent points. And I pretty much stopped the second that I saw that we were accumulating points. And where we are now is we are at Accolade and we are well on our way to Adept. So that's super exciting. And what I wanted to do is spend some of these points that we have. I would like Kenny to be a wizard. So we have three points to spend. We have these areas that are unlocked that we can spend our skill points on. Based off of our character, based off of Kenny, um, I really think that we should spend our points in um, the knowledge area, experimenter, and insightful eye. I think that that's where we want to spend our points for now. And there we did it. All right, so let's get into it. As the snow is falling down, actually, let me collect our seed packets. I don't want to lose those as the snow starts falling because it's going to start getting thicker and thicker and thicker. Oh, maybe we can name our gnome. Good old Harold. Good old Harold the gnome. I mean, he is a cutie. Look, he's winking. Good, cute little guy. What is our plan for today? So I definitely want to make sure that we're upping Kenny's skills. So we'll probably practice a little bit of magic. I've been playing a little bit off camera to up his skills. A big part of this challenge is getting him to be a wizard. So that means that he has to do research. He has to practice. And so it's a lot of repetitive tasks. What is that? Kenny, are you walking around with water in your pocket? You crazy guy. Let's breed our frogs. See, he makes these potions now, which is kind of cool. And then we have all of these flowers that we've been getting from our gnome. We have a lot of stuff that we've been getting from our gnome um, that I want to hold on to. And then these upgrade parts, I never use those. So we can just go ahead and get rid of it. You know, I'd say Kenny's doing a good job. We have almost 2,000 simoleons. And if we need to, we can start digging around in here to gather decorations to sell. It's like, oh gosh, Kenny, our sink is so dirty. Clean it. Let's clean our sink. I think, so as much as I loved Kenny to have this cooler, I think we're at this point now where he could have a refrigerator, like a mini fridge. Okay, let me show you, because we're not totally without, and we could get this university mini fridge, 250 simoleons. I kind of like it, right? And like, then Kenny can actually store his food. Let's sell, let's see. And so we can sell our cooler for 116 simoleons. That kind of helped offset the price. We can make it nice and nice and neutral, which is what we like. I would like to get to a point where we can homey up Kenny's little house. I love that Kenny has a tiny home. We get lots of perks from having a tiny home. So like our relationships build faster. We have bills that are less expensive. There's just so many different perks that come with living in a tiny house. Oh, and it looks like our lemon tree is still making lemons. So that's awesome. Look at that. We can sell all our lemons. I could probably go through and sell a bunch of this that we have in here, but I want to wait until springtime to plant a bunch more. I don't think I have anything for winter. I can plant pears. Oh my goodness, that's great. Okay, cool. I actually need to go through this and see what we have. Kenny, is that mac and cheese? That's a lot of mac and cheese, Kenny. Well, here we are with the giant vat of mac and cheese. I don't know. <laughs> of all the things he could have made or grabbed out of his brand new refrigerator. And also note the time. This is six in the morning that he's making the biggest collection of mac and cheese 
to humankind. I guess not all heroes wear capes, right? Look at all these glasses that he has on here. Kenny, spoiled water made by Dustin. Um, one of the things that Kenny does a lot is, oh, our bills have been delivered. See, okay, so we have all these savings just because we have a teeny tiny house. But one of the things that Kenny does is he talks to this rose bush that we have. Oh, look, we can do magic. Watch. Watch that puddle. Puddle eradicated. Good job. I want to paint the walls. So I think, let me show you the magic that is rummaging through this box. And this is, I'm going to be real honest, this is kind of cheaty and it's, it's fine. <laughs> Um, look, look at that guy. So what we're going to do is we're going to have Kenny rummage for decorations. This is free. This doesn't cost us anything to rummage through this box, right? Let me just show you. Let me show you what happens. Okay, so look at Kenny lurking by all of these decorations. So having this decoration box is really great for your Sims, especially because you can get all these great decorations and decorate your home. It doesn't cost you anything to rummage, right? You just buy the box the one time and you can rummage and it'll have spring, summer, every every kind of decoration that you'll need. Um, and I want, I want paint. I want Kenny to have a nice little house. So that's a hundred simoleons. This is a hundred simoleons. 53, look at, we're already at 3,600 simoleons. We're not even done yet. I could literally have him rummage all day long. All right. And just like that, we have 4,500 simoleons just from selling decoration. I just really want to get him some like interior decoration and it's a small home. So probably don't want it to be super dark. I like, I personally really like yellow and we can go with like retro vibes. Like I'm super inspired by his two posters. I always love a good wood floor. I think that those are great. Um, let's just go with the white for now. And then I think I want to put a bit of um, tile in here in his bathroom section. I think this is good for now. All right. So let's see how much faster Kenny can learn some skills. So I'm going to speed him up. Oh, he's already making potions. So I'm going to keep an eye down here to see how quickly this builds. Oh, Dustin's here. Um, now that Dustin's here, the humor and hijinks festival. Oh, that's exciting. And then let's bring Dustin and Nolan with us because we need friendship time because why wouldn't we? Okay. So I've never actually done the humor and hijinks festival. Where are you going, Kenny? Everybody's going in the other direction. Go here. Stop lurking over there. So I've never done the, the humor and hijinks festival. I know that there is a game component to it. And I think we need to start by... Oh, see, this is where we choose. Do we join the pranksters or do we cho choose the other? Purple or yellow, the jokesters. I think, well, Nolan already grabbed the purple drinks, so we're going to go with the purple punch. I think I like purple drinks more than I like yellow drinks. We're feeling playful. So I know that we need to, basically, we need to tell jokes. So I'm going to tell jokes to Dustin, I guess. Let's see how this goes. I hope that this doesn't ruin our friendship. I'm also very excited to buy like a t-shirt or a snow globe, <laughs> but that's just me. Kenny, he just farted. That is not funny. Kenny keeps tooting. I guess my mischief skill is going up, which I wasn't sure I was working on, but okay. I didn't even do this. Oh my gosh, I'm so stupid. I did the wrong thing. We're not here for casual discussions. I thought I drank the tea already. Drink the tea, Kenny. Yeah, I'm not really sure. I've, I've, I'm now losing interest. I thought that there was like a thing we were supposed to do. Let me check out the swag over here because you know I love a good snow globe. Oh, the pranksters win. Oh, it was a thing and we got, oh, no, I didn't get my snow globe. They closed. Okay, so there's fireworks involved. We get a voodoo doll on the road to fame. Wait, did Kenny get fame? Okay, that's, that's a lot of fireworks. I think we won, which is great. Oh, look at that. We got, we got fire. Okay, that's enough. We get it. Oh, we got a voodoo doll. So we won. Okay, can, yay us. Reparo to a painting? Wouldn't that ruin the painting? What does Kenny do to it? 
Kenny. Kenny? Oh no. Kenny set that painting on fire. We're gonna just walk away from that. Jeez, Kenny. Okay, so I wanna see if there's any like posters. Is there any like boxes or was that just like that one time? Cause like that was fun to get posters. I like a good poster. Oh, here's some posters. Is this a poster? Grab poster, yeah. So I would say that our time here was good. It didn't make a whole ton of sense. For some reason, I thought that the game was a little bit more interactive. Um, so yeah, I think with that, we are gonna go home and assess the situation. I'm very bummed out that I couldn't get a snow globe. I don't understand why Dustin's uncomfortable every time he talks to Kenny. They are literally best friends. Are you mocking Dustin? Kenny, that's rude. Kenny, you've had enough. We're going home. You can't be mocking Dustin. Also, I'd like him to always use his wand when he does magic because that's, that's good. I feel like Kenny could be one of those people that just likes to use chopsticks for the sake of using. Why are they fighting? Oh, okay, they're joking with each other. Okay, that's fine. That's enough. Let's, let's go home, Kenny. Let's assess the situation. All right, let's quickly assess the situation. Also, let's sell our frogs. All right, so we got another poster, and this one is a little different than the one we have already, so that's good. We're just gonna wrap up today with checking out what we got. I'm just gonna throw this up on the wall. That's fine right there. Um, we made some potions. I don't really think I wanna like, I don't know. I kinda don't want the potions. Oh my gosh, wait, Winterfest. Oh, that's exciting. We get to do Winterfest. We're gonna do that tomorrow. So I'm gonna sell all of these humor and hijinks festival things because it just, it doesn't make sense. I don't want, I don't want them. I don't want these fireworks. I would rather have the money. Kenny would rather have the money. Kenny would rather have Winterfest items. We got this voodoo doll. I don't know what to do with it. I would never bind it to anybody. I know that voodoo dolls are worth like a, like a lot of money. I'm just gonna put them up here for now. All right, so we're ending the day with Kenny making more mac and cheese. Okay, well, we already have like 11 servings of mac and cheese in the refrigerator, so what's 11 more? So apparently tomorrow is Winterfest. So when we come back, that's what we're gonna work on. Uh, there's some really fun things that we can do there. It looks like our lemon tree is lemon tree again. Uh, so yeah, thank you all so much for hanging out with me and watching Kenny become a magical sim. We had a fun little detour where we got to go be a funny sim. And I'm not really sure how all that worked, but somehow we won, which is great. And uh, I will see you all in the next video.